When the captain of an oil tanker wants to navigate between the Black Sea and the Mediterranean, there's only one possible route he can take. Ships of up to 300,000 tons, notoriously unmaneuverable and taking miles to stop, somehow have to be nursed through a winding stretch of seaway called the Bosphorus. It's 17 miles long, in places is barely half a mile wide, and has fierce and unpredictable currents. The Bosphorus is so dangerous that on average there are about 10 collisions of varying severity here every year. And the accident rate is particularly serious because of the risk to life ashore. The city of Istanbul lies at the southern end of the Bosphorus. It's the commercial and business capital of Turkey, but it's also a monument to previous greatness. As Constantinople, it was once the center of Byzantium and then held all the riches of the old Ottoman Empire. Today, a few hundred yards from a city of five million people, lies one of the busiest shipping routes in the world. The Bosphorus carries millions of tons of oil every year. There was a great big ball of fire for a start, which kept um, exploding every 20, 25 seconds at one point, small explosions. And if you, a few minutes afterwards, two big explosions happened, and all the windows along here all um, caved in. In November 1979, a 150,000-ton Romanian tanker, the Independenta, collided with a Greek tanker and caught fire in the mouth of the Bosphorus. 50 crewmen were killed, and the ship burned in full view of Istanbul for nearly a month. When the fire eventually burned itself out, there were inevitable public inquiries which blamed the Greek tanker crew and lawsuits were started which have still not been settled. Salvage work has yet to begin.